Good day! In this video, we are going to learn about the real number system. The real number system is made up of six different numbers. They are the natural numbers, whole numbers, integers, rational numbers, irrational numbers, and real numbers. Further, in the future, you will learn more complicated numbers like binary numbers and complex numbers which will be covered in later years. So let's start with natural numbers. What are natural numbers? Natural numbers are just counting numbers like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and all the way to infinity. So we can represent in this diagram on the right what are natural numbers. So natural numbers can be represented with the letter N in the right in the middle and you represented by 1, 2, 3 and all the way to infinity. That is natural numbers. They are counting numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 all the way. The next number are whole numbers. They are natural numbers plus zero. So if you want to have, and they are represented by the letter W. W equals to natural numbers plus zero. So when you add zero to the natural numbers, then it becomes whole numbers. So all natural numbers are whole numbers. Okay? Remember whole, they're like a whole zero is like a whole. So that is how you remember the whole number. The third numbers are integers. What are integers? Integers are natural numbers with their inverses and zero. So it's represented by the letter Z. Z is equal to the integers plus all the negative numbers. Okay? Plus negative numbers. So for example, you're going to add minus 10, minus 50, minus 100. So integers are just numbers like minus a big number, minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, minus 1, plus all the integers, all the whole numbers that you have done before. So all whole numbers are also integers. Great. Now we look at the fourth number. They are called the rational numbers. What are rational numbers? Rational numbers are numbers that can be expressed as a fraction or ratio between two integers. Okay? So all integers are all integers are rational numbers because any integer can be divided by one. So for example, if you take two as an integer, two can be divided by one, 17 can be divided by one. All integers are rational numbers, and rational numbers is represented by the letter Q. Okay. Next, we have another group of numbers which is separate from this group of numbers. They are called irrational numbers. Irrational numbers are numbers that cannot be written as a fraction or a ratio. For example, if you are talking about root 2, it is 1.414213562373309 and carry on and carry on and it is not terminating. So that's why it cannot be written as a fraction. Similarly, you have the golden ratio. The golden ratio is 1 plus root 5 over 2 is equal to 1.618039888 carry on and carry on and it never stops. So that also is a irrational number. And another famous irrational number is pi. Pi is 3.142 and 3.1419265 and a lot more numbers than that. Okay, so these are called irrational numbers and they are represented by the letter P. Okay, so and to end it, we have the real numbers. The real numbers are made up of both the irrational numbers and irrational number and they are represented by letter R and they made up all the numbers on the number line. So that is what we learn about the number system and hope you will learn to remember them, some of them. Cheers everyone, see you soon.